Please stand. Face the flag. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Bears. On today's show, we have a look at our weather for this week and some other important school news. I'm Silas Hammernick. And I'm Emma Hernandez. Today is Monday, December 2nd, and Good Morning John Burroughs starts right now. Welcome back, Bears. Let's start today's show with a reminder for all seniors. If you're working towards the 100-hour service learning recognition for graduation, now is the time to submit your hours. Make sure everything is updated and approved by Mrs. Miranda. You can email her at shannonmirando at burbankusd.org if you have questions about what counts. Don't wait. Get it done today. Also, seniors, don't forget to pick up your senior sweatshirts at the student store. Supplies are running low, so grab yours before they're gone. You don't want to miss out on one of these iconic sweatshirts. Before we continue with our show, let's send it over to Riley Whitaker to take a look at the weather for this week. Good morning, Bears. I'm Riley Whitaker, and I'm here to report this week's weather forecast. This week, we're going to see some warm temperatures with sunny skies. Today, we'll have temperatures of 73 and a low of 48. Tuesday will be a high of 69 and a low of 50. Wednesday has a high of 68 and starts getting cooler to 47. Both Friday and Saturday will be the warmest days of the week, with a high of 78. Finally, Sunday cools back down to 72. That's all for me. Back to you in the studio. Thanks, Riley. Now let's move on to holiday announcements. The Burbank Volunteer Program is looking for students to help with its food drive for the Burbank Coordinating Council Holiday Baskets. Shifts are available this weekend at multiple locations. Sign up through the Career Center Google Classroom. This is a great way to earn service hours and give back this season. Speaking of giving back, don't miss the chance to support GMJB by shopping in our Seize Candy online storefront. The fundraiser runs through this Friday. Check out the flyer in the bulletin for more information. If you're looking to spread some holiday cheer, the JBHS Culinary Class is selling gingerbread ornaments in the quad during lunch in front of the Big Gym. They're $3 each or two for five. If you're sending one to a friend, just make sure you know their fourth period class. Ornaments will be delivered on December 11th and 12th, so get yours before they sell out. Now let's shift gears to athletics. If you're interested in joining the boys' tennis team, trials will be held tomorrow at 3.45 p.m. on the tennis courts. This is a two-part process, so be sure to attend the first day and have your athletic clearance ready. Softball trials for the 2025 spring season are also coming up. They'll take place at Olive Park Field 3 today and tomorrow from 3.15 to 5 p.m. This is your chance to join one of JBHS's most successful programs. Remember, you'll need athletic clearance to participate. If you're interested in track and field, there will be an informational meeting this Friday at 12.56 in the Big Gym. It's important to attend to learn what needs to be done before winter break to join the team next semester. For anyone interested in stunt, round two tryouts are here. Join the Open Gym and meet the coaches event this Thursday from 4 to 6.30 p.m. with tryouts on Friday from 4 to 6 p.m. Register using the link in the JBHS Cheer Stun Instagram bio. Moving on to programs on campus, Link Crew is hosting its annual Cocoa and Craft event this Friday at lunch in the mezzanine. This is a freshman-only event, so grab some hot chocolate and get creative with your friends and leaders before finals kick in. Don't miss this cozy tradition. Now for some club news. The Interact Club meets today at lunch in room 1209, so be sure to stop by. The Portraits of Kindness Club will hold its lunch meeting today with all portraits due. For those interested in tech, the Coding Club meets Tuesday at lunch in room 1214. And if you're into crafts, the Crochet Club also meets on Tuesdays at lunch in room 1145. Don't miss these great opportunities to get involved. That's all for today. I'm Silas Hammernick. And I'm Emma Hernandez. Have an amazing day, Bears.